Welcome back to my dad's YouTube channel. Okay, so, thanks, Esme. Um, so, I promised you last month that every month that Scroller Box sent, sent me a uh, video, uh, sorry, sent me a box, we'd do a video, yeah? Um, so, we haven't opened this yet. We opened this last month, uh, this one, uh, and it got all sorts of, I've been using these, I see all sorts of uh, pens and pencils and in there. It came with a sticker and a, and a, a, a sweet and information and about an artist and it was all about watercolours last month, okay? So let's close that up, Esme. Right, so we're going to open this and yeah. I'm quite excited about this because it's a bit sad. So for fit, this has cost me £15 a month, so it's basically a review this is to see whether it's worth the money. Okay, so Esme's going to uh, try and open it, so just a little pull thing here. Oh, go on. It's like a zipper. I know, it's like a zipper pouch, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, right, are you ready then? Yeah. So we're going to put it down on the table and then we're going to open it. What's in and here? you be careful. So it comes with, wait a minute, it comes with everything in a little parcel so I suppose it doesn't break. And now, a scroll box. Yeah, but. so it's all about what's in the box. I think these are pencils this time. And there's an information about an artist, Phoebe Cripps, who I think that's a self portrait. Um, what's that, Es? Mm. Mm. Little black parcel, what is it? I Don't drop it on the floor like last time. I think it's like a little short thing. If you saw my video last month, Amelia and Esme dropped pretty much everything out of the box onto the floor and we had all sorts of pencils breaking. So which wasn't a very good start, was it, Amelia? Amelia's behind no. the camera right now. Right, so, can you do that? It's so So this sticky. artist, um, she oh, loves... Okay. Um, oh, she was in the Sky Arts Portrait Artist of the Year 2017. She painted Sue Perkins and Amelda Staunton, um, two famous people. Um, she lives in Kent uh, and she predominantly works in shop. Well, listen to this. Here's a clue to what might be in there. It says she portraits people and animals dominant, uh, predominantly working in charcoal and chalk as well as oil. So I think this is all about charcoal, this one this month so let me help you because it's really yeah there's some really so nice hard. bits of charcoal to, to draw with in here oh. look at this picture so we've got pieces of charcoal here mm. okay and then hey up as me oh we've got some lovely pencils again don't drop any on the floor this they're not sharpened but we can use Right. From the right. Past so we've got, oh, these are pastels. These are pastel pencils. I've never had any of these before. It's so, yeah, so one these brown. Are, these are Rembrandt, white and brown. But these are dry. And then we've got this charcoal pencil um, that's come through, which is good. And there's another pencil. What's that one? This what? is a Splendor pencil by Rembrandt. Lyra by... Rembrandt, which are really good pencils. Yeah. Oh, and it's come with a new uh, pencil sharpener and the sweets. I think every single one comes with a sweet or a chocolate. Yeah, so this has come with Coates Willow Charcoal Sticks, two of them, different size ones. That was what was in the black packet. And Sea White Black Compressed Charcoal Block. And then a charcoal pencil, which is that one. And then we've got two chalk pencils, which are these two. And then, what else have we got? Oh, a Splendor pencil, and it's colourless blending pencil. Okay, what are you going to say? Oh, what's that? I don't know, oh, but maybe, I know. maybe you should come down below what you think it is. <laughs> yeah, so we've got a little bit of a, uh, a box of something here. So maybe comment below to see what you think that is. And in the next... In the next scroller box, we'll, we'll tell people what it was. So it's a little box of something, but I'm not going to give it away by turning it over. It's this really is sticky. Sticky, is it? Okay, so we'll leave it's that so as a surprise. Sticky. So in here, we've got... Oh, we've got... Right, wait a minute. We've got an A5 pad, multi-techniques. Um, oh, this, this is grey paper. This looks like a rubber. It looks like a rubber, but it's not a rubber. Yeah. Okay, well, not quite the same as a rubber. Yeah, so this, it looks like a rubber. Yeah, this comes with grey paper, which is really good for pastels and charcoal, which is what I've wanted for ages, but not managed to buy one. I tried to buy an Art Gecko one uh, last week, 
and instead of sending me, wait there is me, instead of sending, wait, wait there, a minute, two seconds, um, instead of sending me, Amazon kindly sent me this through, which is a desert sand card, pieces of card, so I'm going to have to send that back I think, and reorder um, this kind of thing, so this is really good if you want to use white, obviously if you're using white uh, paper like Esme's, this is yeah. Esme's one. Well, look at my gecko. Pad. Yeah, this is art gecko pads, isn't it? White paper. Um, if, come this side so they can see. If you can see any of my drawings, yeah, that but you right can't. Right? The problem with this Esme is you can't use white on white, can you? So that's used for any uh, grey colours or any white colours. And there's a butterfly in this one. Um, she's done a butterfly and angry birds and a narwhal. Brilliant. I so, tried this, but I couldn't do it by myself. So that's the school box. Do you think it's worth fifteen pounds, as me? Uh, yeah. Do you think so? See, those those pencils are about three pound each to buy. Uh, so there's four of those. This is way more than fifteen pounds worth. Uh, especially the pad. The pad's quite expensive. Claire Fontaine pad. Um, really quite expensive pads. The those first are. one came with this. Uh, no, it didn't. That's ours. No, it didn't come oh. with ours. That's ours. That is. Um. So I think May's scroller box definitely worth fifteen pounds. So I'm going to do a bit of research on Phoebe Cripps um, and have a look at her website if you want to check her out. She's uh, she's got a website called Phoebe Cripps C R I double P S dot com, uh, and she's on Instagram as Phoebe Cripps Artist. Um, so they feature an artist every month. I've applied to be uh, the feature artist and scroll scroller box as well, but they uh, they get inundated with artists asking so. Uh, one day it might be me. Yeah, never know. Anyway, um, see you soon. Come on, come back. Esme's gone wandering. Come, come and say goodbye. Come say goodbye. She's got charcoal all over her fingers now. Um, see you soon. Take care.